Hello everyone. Um bo -bo 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 -bo. today we are playing Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Now, um because I never think ahead about such things, I don't actually know how stable this is going to run. Um because what we are doing is we are running off of the actual PS2 disc. So this could either go well or it could go terribly. I'm not sure yet. <laughs> to be perfectly honest with you, I'm not entirely sure if this is going to work or if this isn't going to work. If it isn't going to work, I know a fix. Um, I will just have to go on to a little bit of an intermission. Oh, it's trying. Right, we're just going to go ahead and mute that for now, just... Oh, this is the most cursed thing in the world. Will be in mortal danger. Right. If it starts cutting in and out, don't worry, that's not you, that's me. This is the most cursed intro. Oh my gosh. You know what? Just for now, we're gonna we're gonna give the game a bit of a chance to uh, get to where it needs to be, um, and then we will start. All right. It's uh, it's nearly there. It's just really struggling. Oh, ba -ba -ba. right. That was the most unstable thing I've ever seen in my life. Check the controller works. Um, yep, that's fine. So we're going to go ahead and start a new game. And uh, I really hope it doesn't struggle as much as I think it's going to. <laughs> uh, it's not like a problem, necessarily, like if it, um, if it is going to struggle. Like, like I say, I know a fix, but it's just such a pain to... Uh, to have to go out and do. Mm. Um. Oh. Boo, 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 boo. I really hope it doesn't take as long. I'm really, really hoping. Like I can hear, I can hear the disc tray. I think trying to run the disc might be the problem. And I, I know that's the case. <laughs> um. Oh, come on, please. Please, 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 please. I mean, this will certainly make the, um, the game more interesting to try and play. If <laughs> it's going to be this difficult with me. Um, hmm. oh, okay. This might be a problem. <laughs> oh no. Hmm. Right, we're going to persevere and hope 
that it can actually get to the game. If it can't, then I might have to, uh... Oh... This, uh... This is gonna be a problem. Especially because I know how many, like, loading screens there are in this game. Uh... Yeah, that's uh, that's gonna be a problem. <laughs> I can just hear it whirring and like revving up the uh, the disc tray. Oh, it's 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 it's, it's trying its best. Oh, no, I can, uh, <laughs> it really isn't liking this at all, not in the slightest. That is a, <laughs> that is a horrible sound. <laughs> oh my days. Right, um, hmm, hmm, <laughs> right, we might have to take a very quick couple minute break whilst I sort this. I mean I can I can do it whilst it's trying to load. I suppose. Um oh now it knows that I'm uh I mean that's Sort of it. Right. Oh. Is it going to be cursed? Welcome to the borough, Harry. I will just download Did this. Did any of you ever uh, give a thought of how worried I'd be? Byzantine, no note, car. Oh, oh no! Oh no! Right. Did you care? Never. As long as I've lived. Hmm. Now get outside and start denoming. Right. I've had it up to here with all of you, except you, of course, Harry. I'm not cross with you. I don't even know if my internet will be able to handle. You ready to do a bit of denoming, then, two Harry? things going at once. Well, I'm not sure, Ron. I've been with the Dursleys so much this summer. I'm a little rusty. Ah. Oh. Like it, it seems okay enough. Um, the music kind of becomes a little bit cursed every now and again, but other than that, it seems okay. Um, the cam, oh, yeah, the camera is even worse in this game. However, like. Besides the massive glaring matrix glitch, we actually seem to be doing pretty okay. Um, so this is the Weasley Borough? That was truly smashing, Harry! You oh. Keep collecting the beans, Harry. They'll come in very useful at Hogwarts, won't they, Fred? They certainly will. Especially useful for us. Nintendo! Once you learn some second year magic, you'll be able to ring the bell. Mm -hmm. You know, Harry, you can cast Lipendo on a whole bunch of things lying around the burrow. And if you do, you might be surprised at what you find. I'll tell you what, it's already doing... It's already doing so much better. Oh, 
Fred's struggling a bit. <laughs> oh no. Oh, Harry knows what's up. <laughs> he knows something's going up. Mm, pardon me. Mm. Uh, 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 are you okay there, Fred? I like how I instinctively knew that it was Fred. Come on, Harry! We're in here! I mean, I think Fred needs some help. Oh no. They're up in the rafters. Okay, Harry. Target the little pests and flipendo them off the rafter. Hmm. Nintendo! That's got one! Right. Bot bean. At least they fixed the beans. That was pretty good, Harry. You've got the little pests on the run. Hurrah. Right. But... Pardon me. Now, I could have sworn that there was a way to uh because there's a there's a little wizardy card up there and Come on. Harry, we're out here. yeah i know ron i'm trying to figure out how i get that little wizard's card up there Dependo. right okay we're waiting in the barnyard harry harry oh. we'd like you to meet our washing machine huh, huh? Dad's right, charming. Now no, it's anything, anything but charming. charming. This is a good opportunity to protect some dueling. Dueling? And keep moving round to them cast the panda when the door is open. Don't be scared, Harry. It won't bite oh. much. It's even made even more cast scary when its doors open. by the fact that this like matrix glitch is going on. Watch out! You can only damage it when the doors open. Alright, that should be down. Yeah. Right. Just gonna knock that audio down a little bit. That sorted it, Harry. I'd love to see that in our petunia's kitchen. You do look like you, you need a chocolate, chocolate frog. Here, Here you go. go. You have to knock the frog out before you can catch it. Right. Let's go. Throw some gnomes. Oh, come on, Harry. Ba 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 na ba na We need to get a move on with the denomies. Mum will go mad if she finds any gnomes left in the garden. Look! There's one over there! What you have to do is flipendo them until they're dazed and confused. Wow! I've gotta try this! <laughs> then you grab hold of them uh. and spin them round. And, and chuck, chuck them out of the garden! garden. That went miles! Oh. Oh no. Okay. What? Nintendo. Harry, aim for the gnome. Otherwise, he's gonna run to you. Alright. Come on. Let's go. Right. This bit might be more difficult with a cursed game like this. Excellent. Because if it's going to lag every time. My first wizard card. Oh. Oh. 101. We ain't going to do that. Right. Let's go again. Pick him up. We're gonna go over to here. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Whoopsies. Get it. Yeah. Blah. Oh, the voice acting for these gnomes is so funny. Oh, I keep. I keep letting go to. I need to remember that I kind of need to let go just prior. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, come on. Yep, Harry, you spent the entire last of your... You spent the entire last year exclaiming each and every flavour you eat. That was terrible. Oh, that is shameful. Yep, I know, run. Oh, I don't even beat his record. Hold on. I'm not, like, wanting to necessarily get all the cards, but it would be nice. It would also be nice if the camera were to move. One, two, three. Ugh, oh, amazing. Time for bed. Big day tomorrow. Diagon Alley, then platform nine and three quarters. For someone who's never denamed before, you've done an, an excellent, excellent job, job, Harry. Harry. Almost as good as Lord Royal Lockhart himself. himself. Thanks, Mrs. Weasley. <sighs> but that was fun. Mrs. Weasley woke them all early the following Wednesday. She took a flower pot off the kitchen mantelpiece and everyone grabbed a handful of flu powder. Harry had never travelled by flu powder before, and when he scattered the powder into the fireplace, he immediately swallowed a lot of hot ash. <coughs> it felt as though he was being sucked down a giant plug hole. Harry tried to keep his eyes open, but the whirling made him feel sick. He closed his eyes, wishing it would stop, and, and then, then he, he fell. fell. Good job, Harry. Oh no, loading the screen. Okay, this will be interesting. I mean, it, it seems to have calmed down, like I can't hear the disk drive anymore, so... Might be okay. He says. Possibly. Oh, oh. Oh, no, I can hear the disk drive again. Oh, no. Uh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Hmm. See, the problem is, is that if I start a download, I, I really don't think that the internet is going to appreciate that very much.
Oh, that actually scared me then. This <laughs> doesn't look like diagonally. Oh, it's it's. Uh, he knows that just by looking at the the rear of that wardrobe, he's like. I know my wood. That ain't in Diagon Alley, my friend. Right. Oops. Alright. No way through there. I like how he checks by just pushing on the door. That ain't how doors work, my dude. Just sort of uh, getting as much stuff as I can. That skull always terrified me when I was younger. Oh, he had a panic. He had a panic attack for like point one of a second. Mr. Baldwin. Mr. Malfoy, what a pleasure to see you again. The Ministry of Magic is conducting more raids, and I have a few more uh, items like this at home that, that might embarrass me. Items, items that you are willing to sell? Correct. But I'll, I'll expect you, you tomorrow at the manor to pick, to pick them up. Them up. Good, Good day. day. Good day, day Mr. Malfoy. I'm so annoyed that this guy was never actually put into the films. Like, they filmed one deleted scene in Chamber of Secrets with him, and then that was it. Because this is Borgen and Burks, the, the uninitiated. <laughs> so, uh, what's on there is we set up a very friendly little hand who's going to help guide our way uh, in this game. Just kidding. It has a protective spell. Oh, crap. Maybe if I try creeping up on that thing. Wow, the mm, well. Maybe I could use this to find my way out. We think so. Um, but if I know the glitches in this game, I know that this might be a problem. Oh, I... The... The, Very dark in here. the upgrade from just the first game to this game is just so major. Like, even just the smoothness of the animations, the smoothness of setting Lumos, like, it's so nice. I just, oh, I love it. Oops. Oh, Harry. Are you gonna move? There we go. Oh. Just uh, quick fingers. Come, last one. There you are, my friend. Up we go. Oh no, Harry! I meant I meant for you to aim down a little bit. Just a little bit. 
There we go. Where can I put it? <clears throat> Probably in the cage. No, Harry, aim for the imp. You imbecile. Boop. Hey, wizard card. There's a door here. Nope, not through there. So this guy has a lot of useless doors. Oh, we have to shoot it and tell you something. No, nope, parry. Aim at the frog. What? Aim at the frog. There we go. Good man. That was a lot shorter than I remember. I remember it being a big little hoo-ha animation. Oh well. Hedwig! Hedwig! Hedwig, wig, wig, wig. To be fair, Hedwig is very useful in this game. Here you go. Although, head. I don't understand why head. Why do we have to feed our bird every time we need help? That seems a little bit inconsiderate of Hedwig. That we have to. Feed, his master has to feed him before he will help him. Also, this camera. My gosh, just work with me, please. <clears throat> oh yeah, until we can uh, charge spells. This is actually going to be so painful. Because they're just going to constantly keep going up. Now if I remember... There, there isn't a way to get to that um, chest until we get that, so... Uh, we're just going to fall through there and come back up. And hopefully not fall through any more either. Oh, camera. Please work with me. Right, that's one way to do it. <laughs> that's one way to do it. There we go, wizard card. I don't send the big musical cue there, but thank you. <clears throat> so I can go out that way. I can't go out that way. Bing bong. What? That's never been a th How did I do that? What? Okay, this game is like running on some speedy boy. Because that has never happened before. I just ran straight through. I I've never... Out of all the times that I've played this game... I've never seen that happen. Wow. I tell you what, if we come across some like good old speed running hacks. Mm -hmm. 
Another wizard card. Bang. What what is with that musical cue just every time? Right, can we do that speedrun strat again? Oh, very close. I like how Harry is already dressed to go to Hogwarts as well. Like, who would do that? Like, if I remember in like most of the films, they pretty much didn't get changed until they were either on the train or were like in their dorms. I mean, like, in the sixth film, they were just like, eh, we're however old we are at that point, like, what, 16? No. No, they were more than 16, weren't they, because they had Butterbeer. So it was, like, 16 or 18? And they were just like, eh, we'll, we'll, we'll get changed when we want. Don't worry, we're going to go. I mean, I don't want to jinx it, but provided that this doesn't crash or completely break my CD-ROM, uh, I think we should be okay. Although, looking at it just now, let me just um, click out for a minute. Just going to look at the log. You guys can't see this, obviously. Um, I mean, I don't know what any of this means. I'm looking at something that you guys can't see currently, and, uh, yeah. Okay. Um... Unknown, unknown Vif CMD. That's a lot of them. All right, we might have to switch over, which is very annoying for me, because that means I have to play again. Oh. Oh, now that it heard I might be closing out. Mechanical sympathy, come on. Give me a shred of mechanical sympathy, please. Come on. Come on, you were nearly there. Come on. Keeps black framing. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. I can hear the disc drum ripping itself apart trying to read the disc. Come on. Right. Um, I think uh, playing through the disc wasn't the smartest idea in the world. Wow. Just like looking at the back of the box. So... We're in. Right, so we've just escaped Morgan and Burks now. Harry is, uh, uh, Becca, Be <laughs> I don't even know what the word was that I was aiming for then. Harry is beckoning us forwards. He's doing his signature climb in the air move, of course. Uh, we're going to need to come back to that later, so that's fine. gone one foul place too far. I was frantic with worry. What's wrong, Ginny? You don't look very happy. The flu powder went wrong, and I dropped all my things in the fi fireplace as I passed. Would you like me to go and look for them? That's so kind of you, Harry, but I think you'll need to get your things first. What was on your school list? A copy of the standard book of spells, grade two, from Flourish and Blot, and a new potion bar from Mole Peppers. Well, let's cool. all go to Florida and then. blocks then. Oh, and you might need this. It fell into the hearth when you used the flu powder. A silver sickle. 
French, Mrs. Weasley. Come on, Harry. Let's go to Flourish and Blots. Flourish and Blots, the library. Let's go. I mean, all of these storefronts are about as indistinguishable as you would imagine, but it's full of books. So I would guess it's that one. I don't know what that was. That was a weird remix, that was. <laughs> right. I think the PC might have... hopefully learnt. He says. Yeah, good man. Right. I know that this place is full of beans. Give me these beans. Nope. Give me the beans. Nope. There's a lot of people whispering, but as far as I'm aware, we're the only ones in here. Harry's uh, delusions are coming back. There's a peasant coughing now. I mean, like, these are the same whisperings that he was hearing, like, when he was in school. Like, when the pictures, like, whisper to you, the portraits. More to be fair, these are going to be useful later on. He's very excited for these beans. They're probably older than him if they're stuck in some bookshelves. Another bean. Right, we are gonna obviously stop when we hit fifty. So, uh... oh yeah, I've still got to get the the things sick. I'll have an Another Bertie Bot's bean. But come on, give me the rest of the beans. Give me the last few. Um, what? It doesn't let me go there. I'll tell you what, this is a nice library. Much better than the uh, water stones that we have here. Right, that's 50. I'd like to buy that, please. With the knowledge contained in this book, you'll be when did we get a sickle? Was I just not paying attention? Or... Here's a helpful hint from the book, just for you. Build up the power on your wand and cast it when the and spell, spell is ready. ready. Careful, don't travel. Don't, don't, don't follow your spells. Or you can end up in a spot of trouble. trouble. Thanks very much. What librarian reads out the book to you? <laughs> like, I'm not illiterate. I am able to read the book myself. Thank you. Did you get your book? Yes, Mrs. Weasley. I can't wait to try out what I've learned. Where did you lose your beans, Ginny? I think I dropped my brass scales when I passed the fireplace to the magical menagerie. My new quill definitely fell into the back of Gambling Jake's. And I'm sure I saw Hagrid when I lost my spellotape. So I think I must have been in the cauldron. Hmm. 
the hell is Spellotape? Gamble and Jake and the Leaky Cauldron. Got it. We really appreciate this, Harry. It is so kind of you to do this for Jimmy. Yes, Harry. Thanks so much. Now go on. Show us what you can do with your new spells. Bet you can smash those barrels over there. Oh, sorry. I'm just gonna update OBS slightly. Harry will just kind of do some weird movements towards us to beckon us forward. I don't know what happened there. Interesting. It's uh sorry about this guys. It's just not letting me do it for some reason. Ah, uh, oops, that's definitely not what I wanted. Nope. Stop it. Right. Um, that'll be in properties, I think. No, it's not. If I put that there. Hmm. Okay, this is a problem. Because I can't get into view. Reset. Ah! There we go. Alright, let's just move that down there. So you guys can clearly see it. At least I'm hoping that you guys can see it. Yeah, you can. Okay. There we go. Right, we shall continue. We shall continue. Sorry everyone, I was just setting up the um Oh this guy's gonna get in my way. Dude, move. A silver sickle. Right, um what we're gonna do, we're gonna run back because there's a lot of them. Over yonder, go oh, this way. Well, okay, the, the spell's just sort of autoing. This is deafening, just by the way. That's a lot of sickles. 11 sickles. That is a lot of sickles. It's also some up here, but I'm trying to remember if the game like cuts you off. Like it just. Yeah, see, they're empty now. Yeah. See, I bet if I didn't pick them up, it would have given me more. Oh well. Oh well. Uh, right, so I need to buy a potion vial, 
scales, so I'll take quill. So let's go in here. Because then I can get that done out of the way. I can buy the uh, potion vial. And then we can just... I'm just going to put that up there. Long cutscene, not cutscene, um, loading screen. <laughs> oh, I've just realized my bed's in view, isn't it? Oh, no. <laughs> Hmm. See, this is the problem with having like um, a webcam that has like such a a random like lens angle. Like it picks up more than it needs to realistically. Excuse me. Buy that for eight. That was eight sickles, my dude. Brilliant. Wow. Thank you. You're very welcome to fill your potion pile with wigan words. That that is uh. The Wigan Wells in the large cauldron over there. Thanks very much. Wow, that was a right ripoff. That was. That was a right old ripoff, wasn't it? I wonder like how long it actually took them to Right, let's get the uh, the most difficult one out of the way. Or well, the most annoying one at least. I wonder how long it actually took them to make this game. Because obviously back then, I mean this wasn't like the creme de la creme of video game design, but it would have been you know, it would have been enough, wouldn't it? So it just makes me wonder like how long it actually took them to make this game? Because this came out like two thousand and two, because it kind of followed like the um, the films. And the first one came out in two thousand and one, and it realistically can't have been before ninety eight, ninety nine that they would have started making this. So I don't know. Did they maybe do them back to back? Hence, like why they look so similar. I don't know. Hmm. Half this stream is literally just going to be waiting for the game to actually load. Hmm? Said her brass scales were in here somewhere. I stand corrected. It likes to, to surprise me, doesn't it, this game? I love that noise. Oh. I love that noise so much. It's such a nice noise. Oops. That was about to happen. 
Oh, that hissing noise. I love it. I love that noise. <laughs> like, Harry is just up to mischief at this point. He could quite easily just say... He could quite easily just tell the adult, my friend dropped her thing. Go on, go, 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 go. There we go. Easy. I hate that. Right. Nice music. Right, just because that's going to deafen me every time it does it. Oh, I can't even turn it down. Ginger, Gale. Oh, right, let me dare go back to that other music. Just keep it nice and calm, please. That noise is so obnoxious. I know you're here somewhere. Maybe he's by the door that's become unlocked. Well, you could just walk out. He can't exactly He can't exactly hold you hostage, Harry. Game, why would you do that? I must be Easy. Oh, he's coming. He is coming. Skeleton for that music deafens me. Oh my gosh. What is with the dramatic music? Stop. Right, pure silence. That's much better. <laughs> oh, and that's going to play like every single time it comes to a prefect bit, isn't it? Oh, no. That's so annoying. That is really annoying. Uh, so yeah, so just like you know, I'm running a giveaway during the stream as I... So, alright, I'll just... Because then the, uh, <laughs> the, the, the music isn't going to deafen me. So essentially the way that the giveaway works is that each time, so I'm playing through every single Harry Potter game. So I've finally completed Philosopher's Stone and today we've started fresh, we've started anew. We've forgotten the terrible happenings of that first game because of how abysmal it was. <laughs> now some context, I grew up with these games, I'm allowed to call them out for being not as I remembered. You know, some things just don't hold up to scrutiny, or even a light prodding, and that first game really did not. I did not enjoy it, but Chamber of Secrets and Prisoner of Azkaban especially, those games were my childhood, and I grew up playing them for the PS2. 
um, and essentially each time I start a new game in the series I'll be doing a giveaway during that first stream of this game. So for those of you who are joining for this stream, as you can see in the bottom left hand um, of the stream I've explained incredibly quickly how it's going to work. All you literally have to do is type the command exclamation mark enter and you'll be, well, in an ideal world you would be uh, entered into the giveaway and it would be done automatically. However, um, the uh, setup hasn't worked again and I have no way to test it currently. Uh, so we're just going to do it the old fashioned way and anyone that types it in in the chat, I will then enter your name into the spin wheel draw and then at some point during the latter half of the stream, um, I will then spin the wheel, it will pick a winner, and you guys will be sent a uh, Harry Potter pop figure. So for those of you who missed the giveaway for the first game, I gave away a Harry Potter Marauds map uh, and a display case. Um, now, uh, purely due to uh, monetary reasons. Um, if you are in the UK, you can enter. If if you are, oh, thank thank you very much for the uh, the follow, uh, Sally Eddie. Uh, thank you very much for that. So yeah, um, uh, unfortunately, just uh, purely down to monetary and quality control reasons, um, you will only realistically be able to enter if you are in the UK. If you are the US or Australia or outside of the UK. Um, it will be very difficult for me to send it or control the time at which it would get to you. If that isn't a problem and you do end up winning and you still feel, oh, sorry, if you if if you are from outside the UK and you you are okay with that and you do win, um, I essentially DM uh, the winner on Discord or their preferred method of choice um, to obviously get contact details. Um, and if you just want to discuss that with me there, that's totally fine. Uh, yeah, so in order to enter, you simply type in exclamation mark enter, and during the latter half of the stream, I will then be entering all those names into the giveaway. Right, let us continue. So we've just got the, um, we've just collected Ginny's um, spello tape, I believe. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and get... Oh, I've got to try and remember everything now. Um, oh no, I've got her scales, sorry. Gambling Jakes is down here, so we're going to go down here. Where we will meet the friendly... <laughs> Always look decent. Yeah, same. <laughs> it's, um... You know, it's just a... It's just a nice, small, easy way to, uh, to give back uh, to the community, really. You know? Um... Like I've 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 uh get my words out, <laughs> you know I've loved uh I've loved live stream well not live streaming personally but I've loved watching live streaming and um just like when content creators give back to their community you know that's that's ultimately what gives me that joy you know I mean um putting up with uh. Uh, oh, thank you very much for the host as well. Oh my, thank you. <laughs> you, you really didn't have to do that, but uh, thank you, thank you very much, uh, Sally. Um, yeah. Um, I mean, if you if you know anyone personally, like on, uh, uh get my words out. <laughs> I'm really struggling to die. I don't know why. Um, but yeah. Uh, if you know anyone personally that you think, oh, they. Uh, you know they might want a chance to win. Just uh, send them send them a message quickly, and um, yeah, the the giveaway. I usually have a timer running. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yeah. Any. Uh, yes. Uh, Streamlabs. Oh, I'm so glad that popped up. So um, to quickly run through the Discord. Um, so Streamlabs is just the bot, obviously that tells people. Wait, has that notification gone through? Ah, brilliant. <laughs> Sorry, I just got the notification then. Um, 
yeah, so the Discord, the Discord at the moment, as you can tell, is an incredibly tiny, tiny community. It's basically me, um, a couple of my viewers um, that I hope uh, will be joining the stream soon. There are a couple of regulars, uh, Arkham especially, uh, he usually joins uh, kind of later on in the stream. Uh, but it's essentially just the best way to get in touch, um, or the best way to suggest... Oh. I don't know what that audio was then. This is Gamble and Jake, the Wizarding Goat Shop. Ignore the um, Matrix thing on the side, by the way. Um, yeah, ignore the Matrix thing on the side. Uh, it's because I'm running through an emulator. Um, so if there are some slow load times, uh, my PC is rather struggling. Or maybe not the PC, but I'm running it on an emulator but through the disc, just because I tend to find it's slightly more stable than uh, and a lot more safer as well, especially. Uh, oh wow, we've got six people now. <laughs> Hello everyone that's joined the stream. Um, uh, but yeah, um, I've really lost my train of thought now. <laughs> but the... Um... <laughs> oh, hello Oliver. So Oliver... Um, is one of the couple of mods that I've got, just a, a mate of mine that runs part of the, the mod for this, as well as the modding for the um, the Discord server. Um, do you want to sh Oh no, we don't have the emojis, do we? Oh no. Um, if you have a look in our Discord server, one of the channels is uh, Emoji Dictionary. Um, I will go back... Uh, I will get back to the game soon, but um, just kind of running through it. So the emoji dictionary, um, I've created some custom emojis with some um, stickers or, or scissor images that were on my Snapchat. <laughs> uh, yeah, so the giveaway, uh, typically I have like a timer, but for some reason it's not wanting to show up. I don't know why. Um, Typically, I do it in like the last 20 or so minutes because it gives people the right amount of time, you know, um, to enter into the enter into the giveaway. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna we're gonna get back to the game. <laughs> uh, so right now we are trying to collect uh, Ginny's stuff for her because she uh, when she came down the fireplace, uh, unfortunately. Some of her stuff. Oops. I let go way too soon then. Ding. Oh. I love that noise. That noise when it's a perfect flipendo. Just. That is. That is some. Oh. Some ASMR that is. I love that noise. Oh, prepare to get your ears blown out. <laughs> Just by the way. There we go. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm good. <laughs> it's all right. Um, I'm doing all right. Um, my brain has just like completely shut off. <laughs> I can't like think of words at the moment. <laughs> I'm just like overwhelmed, I think. I think that's kind of what it is, is at the moment. I'm just a bit overwhelmed with everything. Um, bit of sensory overload, as it were. Um, but I'm I'm doing all right. Um, had a had a bit of a bit of a quiet day in today. Well, quietish. My um. I, I, obviously, for, if people aren't really that into cars, I I'm not a, not a car, uh, not a petrol head necessarily. Um, but I own like a, you know, I've been driving for a couple of years now, and um, my uh, exhaust sounded like it was coming off of the car, uh, so we took it into the garage today, and uh, apparently it's just a design flaw that the old cars used to have, which is very annoying, but. Uh, the guy at Quick Fit, I literally took it off, got it booked in, and he did it for free. And I was so happy about that, because usually it's like, 
upwards of like a hundred quid to to uh, to get everything fixed. Um... <laughs> uh, so for those who are actually new to the to the Twitch channel, am I a big Harry? Um, I don't know why I even have to think about that as an answer. I I am. <laughs> I just um. Unfortunately, as I've gotten a bit older, it's kind of fell by the wayside. Um, <laughs> uh, now, I've told Oliver this story a few times. Um, when I was in primary school, um, gosh, uh, probably like year one, maybe year two, um, I basically found the Harry Potter films kind of around that time. Uh, like, my sister had the books and I'd read most of them. Uh, that had come out at that time, but I hadn't really watched the films, um, just purely, uh, we, we had them on VHS at the time, and uh, I just wasn't allowed to watch them. Um, but uh, I watched Philosopher's Stone and Chamber of Secrets religiously when I was finally allowed to. Um, so much so, uh, so much so that um, I got inspired to make like a... Um, I mean that's it was Chamber of Secrets actually, but um <laughs> it's a yeah, that's a bit of a running in joke that is. Um but yeah, I had my own Harry Potter club uh in primary school. <laughs> um where we would basically um we would like role play like the different Harry Potter films or like um if we thought of like ideas at home we would write down like little quick notes we would write down quick notes for everyone um so that we could like react uh, so we could act it out probably can from each of the movies yeah <laughs> most likely yeah oh hagrid oh that's a nice upshot of hagrid that is <laughs> Right. This game is such century overload now. <laughs> I've not played it in a while. That was a bait. Me and my friends used to reenact the scenes in the playground. Yeah, exactly. You would like, you'd like, uh, you, uh, we used to spend our break times looking for the perfect sticks to use as ones, and then during lunchtime, we would, <laughs> we would. Uh, we had this part in the playground uh, that was like right at the back, and it was a nice, um, it was a nice like green kind of flat part of the playground, uh, and it was out of everyone's way. You know, people didn't play football on it, and um, we used to use it that much uh, that whenever we would do PE lessons, um, the teachers actually referred to that the teachers actually refer to that as the Harry Potter corner because they would always see us uh, like over there in the part of the playground. <laughs> um... I am just going to change the audio ever so slightly for me. Because it is becoming a bit of a sensory overload. Um, but I'll turn it up for you guys so you can so you can still hear about it. Uh do let me know if like anything is um too quiet or anything. Um just simply for me, like the headphones that I have don't have um Am I gonna get yes. I am so excited for that game. That when when I heard that that was being released, and then when I watched um, the, I, like I I saw it being announced on the PlayStation like when they did the PlayStation Five reveal, <laughs> I just like dropped what I had in my hand and just started clapping, like I am so excited for that game to come out. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, one thing that I do want to do, 
is um oh sorry one thing that i kind of haven't done in my spare time is join like the um the gmod rp server for harry potter like i've watched um call me kevin and people like that play it all the time uh back in the back back in the day you know when the when he used to play it and it just looked like the funniest stuff in the world to me uh so I, I do want to do that at some point, is play that. Um, not necessarily on stream, uh, just personally, just like in my own time. Or at least record it, um, and uh, like upload it. What house am I going to choose? I mean, technically we don't choose the house, you know? <laughs> the, the, well, I mean we, well... It depends how easily influenced you are, I suppose. <laughs> um, I don't know. I would. I would. I'm trying to remember what I used to get in like the Pottermore quiz. I mean, um, I know that I certainly made more than one account in order to get the house that I wanted. Um, but I'm really sure that most people did. <laughs> um, I mean. I'd like to say, um, I'd like to say Ravenclaw, um, but like, Slytherin be hitting kind of different though. Like, oh, oh, uh, my my TikTok for you page is just full of Harry Potter stuff at the moment, and uh, Slytherin be hitting kind of different. <laughs> um, that should be everything. Harry, I found all your things, Ginny. Oh, Harry, you're so wonderful. <laughs> no, really. It was, it was nothing. nothing. You're such a kind boy, boy Harry. Harry. You really deserve a famous witches and wizards card. <laughs> the shot when you had to create a new account because it was totally different. Oh, they changed it. Wow, I didn't actually know that. Thanks, Mrs. Weasley. I um I remember back when that was first released, like when it was first announced that Pottermore was going to be a thing. Um, <laughs> me and my uh, me and my friends back in uh, primary school when it was announced, we um we actually <laughs> we actually used to argue, um like with um the IT admins because they blocked the site, um in school like. I, I can understand why they did, uh, but that, that didn't stop us from, uh, like, uh, campaigning to have it unblocked on the school, uh, on the school internet. Um, I don't remember it ever being unblocked, but I'm sure we found our ways around it. Remastered the whole of Pottermore. Oh, I might actually have to have a look at that then. I might have a look at that. Uh, but in my, uh, in my... In my spare time, I'll have a look at that. Remastered Pottermore. Huh. Great Scott! Oh. Is that? It's Harry Potter! I feel like the voice actor for Gildroy Lockhart in this game, like, he perfectly encapsulated. More in Oh, okay. That actually sounds really cool. That sounds really cool. Bet you loved that, didn't you, Potter? Same as Harry Potter. Leave him alone. He didn't want all that. <laughs> Potter, you've got yourself a girlfriend. I suppose your parents will go hungry for a month to pay wow. for the books you're going to need at home. Lucius went straight there. Here, girl, take this one. That was like, I feel like in the film that was kind of it's such a smoother scene. To help um, poor and needy. Sorry, I've got a. Uh, I've got a kitty leg. Oh no, <laughs> he's gonna carry on for this for a while, isn't he? Public appearances. First, I watch the company you keep. Harry. Went from a Slytherin to a Gryffindor. Mr. Train! Mr. Train? Yes! The 
Oh, what's it? Perhaps it's gonna have five minutes ago. What are we gonna do? I know that Dad took the flying car to work this morning. Went from a Slytherin to a Gratz like her. That's a big change, that is. I mean, not a bad thing. Uh, uh, by any stretch. Um. But a Slytherin to a Gryffindor, that, that is a big, like, personnel. I've always been a fan. I mean, maybe not, like, BuzzFeed quizzes. Because <laughs> they are, uh... But some of them are, some of them are so strange. But, like, um, personality quizzes. I'll meet you in the um, I mean, I've, I've never been one to like the idea of uh, the kind of people, people knowing... Be, being told who they are by an algorithm, essentially. But, um... Like, the, the Pottermore quiz was essentially just... Like, I, I know how a lot of those Ready quizzes... Hogwarts, Harry? I think I'm a true Slytherin at half like that. Yeah, I feel like I kind of am as well, in like a, in a similar fashion. Like, um... A lot of, a lot of my... <laughs> I mean, uh, tick TikTok is obviously not the best yardstick to use, but um, a lot of my TikTok for you page is um, like uh, this video has no tags and no description apart from this, so this video was meant for you, and it's always like um, it's always like character traits. So it's like um, this is your Star Wars character, or this is your D and D build or something like that and it is always like the kind of dark but light-hearted person so like I always get like Anakin or um Malfoy or people like that and it's like well I can kind of see it you know Is it gonna crash? I really hope not. Uh, also, just to let you know, um, I do have a YouTube channel as well. So at the moment, the YouTube channel is just being used as a place for me to kind of store the, the live streams because Twitch only holds them for, I think it's 30 days, and then they get deleted. Um, a bit of a lunar. <laughs> oh, this 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 is when it becomes a bit cursed. Is when there. Uh... Oh, it's it's really trying. It's really trying. <laughs> oh, I don't want it to break. I really don't. Because the problem is, is that I don't actually know. Oh. <laughs> it just it just jumped. Ron Ron, you were you were not pulled from the car, you bail on the car. Ugh. <laughs> oh no, okay. If I was on about sensory overload before. Are you serious? Has that actually just happened? <laughs> oh no. Oh no, that has just happened, has it? Right, let's, uh, <laughs> let's take two. Try again. Let's try that again. Um... Right. My favorite character. Mm. Ooh. Like favorite Harry Potter character. That is a good question. Um. I 
I'd have to say... Mm, I'd have to say serious. I think I'd have to say serious black. Just like... The... The... The dichotomy between just... Oh no, Harry, you're gonna get a bit high there, my dude. Pick it up. You know, for for a person to go through as much as Sirius Black did, and for him to still be, like, a true Gryffindor, just is testament to his character, I feel. Um, you know, like, I... I can barely hold up if someone, like, blames me for something small. But for him to be... For him to be blamed for killing his... His best friends, like, in the entire world. And for him to still... Care. You know, for, for him to still want to be a good person. You know. I think... I think that is a true testament. It's kind of interesting because I've never, I've never really kind of thought about, um. Oh my neck then. Oh, sorry. Um. Interestingly, I, I've never actually thought about who my favorite character is, and the fact that it's um, serious is kind of interesting because you, you obviously ask a lot of people, um, or any sort of Harry Potter fan. I feel like a lot of people's go-to would possibly be Neville, because he's kind of a bit of a similar-ish sort of build in terms of like character arc. You know, he he was downtrodden from the beginning. You know, he he certainly didn't have the best childhood, and for him to still for him to still be worthy, you know, I feel like. I feel like Neville could have become a a very powerful Slytherin had he have chosen to do it. Yeah, Remus, Remus. Ah, uh, I feel like he was hard done by, uh, like in the films. This is going to be a problem. Oh, Harry, just aim a little bit higher. Oh, absolutely. Like, if I like, it's it's been a it's been a hot minute since I've read the books. But um, if I remember. In the um sorry, just gonna gonna take a quick sippy. Uh if I remember in the books, um Remus and uh Sirius's relationship was certainly so much more detailed. Even just in the third book, you know, and in the fourth film of the fourth film, the fourth book, sorry. Um Oh, my God, my God. Right. What? There we go. Hmm. Right. There we go. Up to the little doo. That was it, yeah. That was it. Like I say, it's uh, it's been a it's been a hot minute since I've since I've read the box, unfortunately. Um, I still have them. I still have them, but um, 
just like free time. Free time isn't as much as I, I would certainly like to have. Um, certainly like having the. Um, what they called audiobooks. <laughs> See, my my brain tonight is just on the frazzle. And I just can't think properly. Uh, when they did the um, when they did the Harry Potter readings um, during like the first lockdown. Um, that was such a breath of fresh air for me for the books, uh, just to hear the stories again after so many years of not being able to read them, just down to lack of time. Right, what are we gonna do? So, Harry, don't go there, you're gonna, gonna get high, my dude. Oh, now I've got to remember where it all is. Alright, there we go. No, Harry. Oh, Harry. Right, carry. Throw. That ain't what I wanted to happen. Oh, no. Right. No, throw. Harry, step away. Step up. He don't. He don't want to step away. There we go. He, uh, Harry. Harry is very stubborn. And Are you serious? Oh. Okay. I'm gonna have to try and think. I mean, the the noise is certainly not helping me at all. It just sounds like a depressing, just exhale of air, rather than anything else. Oh, this camera. Am I actually struggling? Right, throw. Oh my gosh, come on. I was just like, eh. Oh, there we go. He plays him like a man who's out to make a stage books <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It, um I don't know, I think I think that's kind of just down to movie interpretations, isn't it? You know, like um I mean Ron Ron in the books to the film, you know, it's it's entirely different. Um which is definitely a shame for Ron, I feel. I feel like he got a bit of a bad rap. Um, certainly. Uh, from the from the books to the film. I feel like I'm just being dumb as hell. I feel like I definitely have what I need. Oh, it's because I didn't actually need him. I didn't. I didn't actually need to get anything. Yeah. All right. Hopefully these dogs are certainly easier than they were in the first game. Yes. Look, that is how you make damage, my dude. Oh no, okay. Oh no. <laughs> Harry got yeeted then. That was not what I wanted to happen. These these dogs are so much easier than in the first game. If you miss that stream I I've never been closer to quitting a get like rage quitting a game. Because it was so janky. <laughs> Right, come here, come here, doggo. Oh, okay, didn't want that, but there we go. Oh no, 
Okay, bit too, bit too much on the spell, Harry. I think what I can give props to the first game though is definitely camera work. Like they, they did good with what they had. Oh no! Okay. Come on. Right. Running into him is not going to help, Harry. Oh. Easy. Easy. Didn't even die once. Uh. Smooth brain. What was that for, Al? <laughs> I'm sorry, I've only just looked at um Oliver called me a smooth brain. I don't know why. <laughs> Keeps DMing me. Right. Um I think outside of the stream I might kind of test a couple different things just to see, like if I can. Uh, get it to work. That was close. Right, I can hear a... Oh, yes, Bill Bile. That's what I need. Uh, sorry, I might um, test a couple of things out just to see if I can improve that launch time or that, that um, load screen time because uh, it's a little bit ridiculous. <laughs> to say the very least. It's a little bit ridiculous. Um, so I might try and see if I can get that working a different way. Like, uh, ready for the next stream, which is going to be next Tuesday. So, yeah, to explain my schedule a little bit, just because Twitch doesn't really have the best design for it. So essentially, um, I want to try and make this stream hobby as consistent. Shut up for a second, Ron. Ron's, Ron's taking the stream. So, um, right, Ron's not going to be quiet, is he? <laughs> Oh, Ronald. Ronald's being noisy. So, um, I'll, I'll probably explain the schedule once this bit's over, actually. Just because I know that the music gets uh, a little bit too loud sometimes. Alright. The game lagging is uh, really not going to be the most useful. Ow. Right, thank you Hedwig for the tactical drop. It's once he starts picking up the car that it gets a bit annoying. If I remember correctly. Gonna, yeah, he's going to get the car. However, I don't think he actually moves about, or if he does, it's scripted. Yeah, there we go. Oh. Yeah, if I remember, it's just a scripted movement. Ow. Alright, one more hit and he should be down. Come on, Hedwig, another tactical drop for me. Yeah, there we go. Right. Where's he gonna go? Is he gonna get the car? Oh, <laughs> that was a bit close. Run to the other side, Harry. Oh, come on. 
Away you go. Ah, uh, okay. One. Two. Boom. Sorry, I was gonna, I was gonna explain my schedule, wasn't I? Yes. So the schedule, essentially, I want this to kind of be as um, consistent as possible. So every Tuesday and every Thursday at six p.m. will be a stream with just me. So Tuesday is always going to be Harry Potter, and I'm playing through every single Harry Potter PS2 game, and I'm I'm eighty percent certain that up until Half Blood Prince. There is a PS2 game, and then for Deathly Hallows Part 1 and 2, um, I'll just have to find a PC version somehow. Um, probably going to have to run it off of a disc, because I don't know anywhere that actually hosts the games anymore. Steam used to have them, uh, but they haven't had them for a, a good long while. Uh, and then Thursdays. Thursdays, I don't really have a plan necessarily. Um, I mean, like, last... Last Thursday was basically just finishing off uh, Philosopher's Stone. But um, I kind of want to play, like, some of my older style games that I just haven't played in a while and just kind of want to enjoy. Um, so for the moment, I've put in uh, Star Wars Force Unleashed uh, just because I love the game, I love the story, I love the characters, I love the lore that it adds, even though it's technically not canon anymore. Um... But yeah, uh, I, I definitely want to play that. Um, uh, and then on the weekends, that's when I do multiplayer stuff with uh, me and my friends. So Oliver, who's uh, one of the moderators, and um, usually Tommy as well. So usually it's just me, Oliver, and Tommy. So last weekend, um, I streamed a bit of Left 4 Dead. Um, it wasn't really a planned stream. It was just kind of, we're playing it just kind of boot it up and just kind of let it run in the background um but we've been uh, we've been getting into our survival games a lot um so we uh, we just started up playing the forest and we played for probably about three four hours a couple of days ago um and we've uh, completed stuff like the raft together and we've really been enjoying playing survival games um uh, we do we do love Sea of Thieves as well, um, so that's uh, that's typically something that will pop up every now and again is playing some Sea of Thieves just because we love it. It's it's so much fun. <laughs> um, the actual length of those screen streams and the start times I have just put six o'clock, but uh, they could start at any time and they they could end at any time because it's not. Um, I feel like I'm not in a place where I should be telling my friends what time we're going to play a game. I feel like that's a bit rude. Um, obviously, I asked them prior uh, prior to me going live but if they feel comfortable with me streaming it. So, um, you know, we're all, we're all good mates and, you know, we do look after each other. Um, <laughs> oh, Snape, you do not look good, my friend. In my search of the ground, I noticed that considerable damage seems to have been done to a very valuable Swamping Willow. I'll be speaking with Professor McGonagall later. What tree did more damage to us than we Silence. I would advise you both to make your way immediately to the common, co common room. But Professor Snape, we go so, and count yourselves lucky. If I should catch either of you out of fact, I'll definitely deduct house points. Ah, oh, Snape, Snape, Snapey, Snape. I've just thought, but in the games, 
Snape's story is never actually explained. At all. It's never explained. I've only just realised this. So like if I like get to your common room, Potter. Mr. Potter, you are dismissed. Go to your common room. Ah. <laughs> uh. To your common room. Now. That was <laughs> that was not Snape. <laughs> what happened there? Oh. Come on then. Snapey boy. Room, what are you doing thinking? What are you thinking about Snape? Oh, I keep missing him. <laughs> Uh, I do believe, uh, that's a bit of a broken texture. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, come on game. Try your best. Um, I was going to say, sorry. Uh, so once we reach the common room, um, I mean, uh, <laughs> yeah. Come on, game. Are you back to life? Are you back to life? Are you going to float? Do, 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 do. Are you going to float? Are you going to load? Oh. I can hear my dis I can hear my dis tray just tearing itself apart. See, I don't really understand why um, the prefects just don't seem to care on this night in particular. But then every other night, they're like, Come "Yeah, on, Harry. we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna catch him." Uh, like I say, we're gonna we're gonna get to the common room. We're gonna hear if Ron is tired at all, which he probably will be. 
Uh, and then we're going to end the stream. <laughs> Uh, so just to clarify about the giveaway, um, so as of currently, uh, Sally is the uh, single entry into the giveaway, um, and out of fairness, um, Sally is the winner. <laughs> um, so I will mess um I will message you privately um via Discord. Uh so that we can exchange contact details and I can get that sent to you. Um it won't be sent off immediately, just purely because I am at work tomorrow and by the time I get back home the post office will be closed. Um but I will get it sent off the day after, so Thursday. I had to think about what day it was then. Um, Ba, 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 ba. I mean, if the game gives me a chance to get to the Gryffindor Con rooms, that is. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Ah. Uh, so for those of you who haven't already, uh, we have a Discord set up so that you can... Um... Oh, sorry, I've got a dead leg. <laughs> I'm trying to get the blood flowing to it. Uh, so yeah, for those of you who haven't already, we have a Discord set up so that uh, that is the best way to get in contact. If you have any suggestions for streams, um, if you just want to chat about uh, any games or anything or any recent announcements. Oh, I forgot the Headless Nick was in this. Why, <laughs> Rules are all there for a reason. Well, sometimes a reason escapes me. You shouldn't be up this late, you know. Go back to Gryffindor Com room while Professor Snape catch you again. Goodbye. <laughs> okay, let's go to the seventh floor. Um, but yeah, we have a Discord channel set up, and I also have a YouTube channel where um. Currently, it's um, a lot of old videos from uh, back in the day when I used to do it on the off the off the wrist, you know, off the wrist from the hip. I don't know. I don't know what the saying is. <laughs> Just like whenever, whenever I had the chance, I would upload a random gaming video. Um, but yeah, as of right now, it's uh, a place where I'm going to be storing and uploading all of the stream VODs so for people who um you know maybe didn't have a chance to catch catch the stream live um and then further on down the line once I get more comfortable with um editing and like practicing a little bit I will start cutting the streams down um but first and foremost it will be streams um you know that's it's it's the easiest way for me to do it, and, you know, <laughs> um, yeah, so, you know, make sure to join the Discord server, which also will let you know when it is that I go live, provided that the bot works, because sometimes it doesn't. Make sure to, uh, obviously, follow the Twitch channel directly so that you will get a push notification uh, as and when I do go live, uh, because, as I say, the weekend streams um you know when i'm playing with my friends uh they won't always begin and end at the same times um and we don't we don't always have a plan you know <laughs> but 
I want to thank everyone that has joined the stream and everyone who has enjoyed it so far. Um, like I say, once uh, once it loads, uh, at least into the next day, and then I can save. And uh, after that, I will see you guys here back here on Thursday for something. <laughs> and uh, like I say, I don't really have to plan my Thursday streams. It's just kind of whatever pops into my head on the day, really. Um, but as a, as a person that joined this community rather recently, you know, I started doing this the back end of November um, as a um, just as a test to myself, really. But it's something, um, you know, it's something that has, uh, e even just from small interactions with people, it's something that has, has changed me personally, you know. Um, as as uh, for people who do know me and for people that don't know me, um, you know, my uh, personality isn't always the most outgoing, but by doing these streams and by being able to talk to you guys, you know, my aim is to improve that way, you know, and just build that. That's a bit rude, Ron. And build that community, you know. Oh, here she is. Here she is, Hermione. Wattlebird. Wattlebird. They couldn't even hold the door open for me. They couldn't even hold the door open. Disgraceful. Um. Oh no, because it's Fred and George's shop, isn't it? Fred and George have set up a shop. You can trade all kinds of things with them to sell the really wicked stuff. Wow, I must go and see them. Where are they? Go through that door and through the reading room. There's a portrait on the. I don't know why, but. What's the password? <laughs> Liberty Gibbet. Just the way that the way that some of the lines are delivered just. They always get me. I don't know what it is, but just some of the way that the lines are delivered, they just really tittle me. I don't, I don't understand it. You know what? We'll, uh, we'll go and visit friend George, and then we'll, we'll call it a night. You know, make it, make it a bit even, rather than uh, starting next week and then having to watch a, uh, a load screen instantly. Um. Like I say, hopefully, uh, come next stream, that will be fixed, or at least somewhat faster. Um, oh. Come on. Um, just, just to uh, explain why it is I'm running off of the PS2 disc and why I have it. So, um, I have had four PlayStation 2s throughout my life, um, most of which have been down to me buy uh, buying and then selling it off a couple years later and then rebuying it again, purely because I want to play these. Um, now I've had this emulator for some time, um, but, uh, I think it was during the middle part of last year, um, or maybe a little bit before that, um, the emulator stopped working for these games, um, and the developers at the time weren't, weren't able to fix it, essentially. Um, so, went out, bought a PS2 from CX, I think it was, at the time. Um, and that was my most recent one. And then the battery, the, the power supply died on it. So I was stuck with a bunch of PS2 games and no PS2 to play them on. <laughs> um, uh, 
and thankfully um over the last year or so the uh the, the team that made the emulator have fixed it But the bots ever flavor beans. You're sure there's something here you'll like. And thankfully we filled up on them, so we can go and buy some stuff. How much is an edge of Thirty thirty bots every flavor beans. Right, I'm just having to remind myself. How much is an alahamora spellbook? Eighty thirty bots every flavor beans. <laughs> oh, there's one. Just right on the floor. <laughs> Pardon me. Now one of these... Well, actually, a couple of these, if I remember, were special toilets. Right, that's one of them. One of them had, like, a, a card, if I can recall. Or I might be wrong, I'm not too sure. I might be wrong, it might just only be that one. Yep. Dang it. Oh well. Bloop. Um... Now if, <laughs> if I remember correctly... This takes you... Does it take... It doesn't take you downstairs, does it? It takes you... Into the study room? Could be wrong. Oh, the game didn't like that. Ooh, I didn't think you'd see me. <laughs> I didn't think you'd see me. <laughs> right. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna end the day, and then we're gonna fade to black, and we're gonna play some nice, gentle music. I don't actually think I have it up anymore. Silly me. Did I close it? No, I didn't. Okay, that's good. Mm, bloop. It is still playing, though. Which I didn't realize. So, what it was playing out of. Oh, uh, because I... Yeah. <laughs> Whoopsies. See, this is the thing, is like, sometimes, uh, like, my setup... My setup is good, but it could be better. Right, we're going to end the day. And then we're going to save. So, once again... I hope that you all have enjoyed the stream. Thank you very much for those who joined the Discord. Thank you very much for Sally for entering and winning the giveaway, and also for joining the Discord as well. Um, you know, we've got we've got big plans. We've got some big plans, um, especially hint hint uh, when we finally get to uh, Deathly Hallows Part Two. Um, I have a little special, little special giveaway, and uh, I think you guys are gonna like it. Um, and uh, you know, th this is some. This is just a, a little side hobby. You know, it's some. It's some that I enjoy doing. But if I can, if I can make the internet a bit of a happier place, give everyone a bit of nostalgia while I'm at it, and um, 
and build a good community, then I'm all for that, you know? And uh, yeah. ultimately, that is down to you guys. You know, that is down to you guys. Sorry. That's down to you guys sharing about the stream, talking about it, you know, letting your friends know that you found a, uh, another streamer that you watch, you know. Um, you know, ev even if it is that they just join just purely to join the giveaway, you know, it's it's still something, you know. You know, it's still it's still a way for me to give back, and that's ultimately what I want to do, you know. Uh, I certainly don't look at myself as the next Mr. Beast. Um, I'm not in any position at all to do that kind of stuff <laughs> as much as I as much as I would love to. Um, I absolutely look up to Mr. Beast and the stuff that he does. But um, yeah, that guy is on a whole nother level <laughs> in terms of giving back to his community. Um, but yeah, we've got we've got some big plans. We've got some big plans. Um, <laughs> um, so yeah, we're just gonna get a let me. There we go. It's because I keep uh, clicking outside the game. Should work now. Cool. Loop. Loop. Ba 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 da da. Ba 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 da 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 da. So yes, um, once again, thank you everyone so much for joining the stream, um, and I will see you guys on Thursday. Thank you very much for watching, and bye for now.